Well, I've gone through something where, you know, I moved into an apartment and nothing was working. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Nanu back again with another video with my amazing friend. You already know who she is, you should know by now. Hi guys, welcome back to Nanu's channel. I am Viani Amaka. Yeah, so in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are here to give you tips on how to find apartments in Bulgaria. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so let's get right into it. The first thing you should look out for while looking for an apartment in Bulgaria is to look out for the location. Try to, if you're a first year medical student, you're trying to find an apartment that's close to the, the main building. It's even best if you find like an apartment that's connects, kind of connects the the different buildings, buildings together. Yeah, mm -hmm. just maybe in between, you know. Yeah. Another thing we recommend doing is looking at uh, how far the shopping center is, you yeah. know. You don't want to be somewhere where there's no shopping around you, you have to travel miles away or take the bus. <laughs> You yeah. know, but luckily there's a uh, there's leader yeah. not far yeah. from uh, another building, the pharmacy building. So, yeah, like uh, Vianney said, location is very important because mainly first and second year you're at the main building of the university and just the other ones. So yeah, yeah. For the third tip, you should try and find out how secure and um, clean the area is because some buildings it all depends on how much you have the more secure ones are really on the higher end yeah. but they are generally apartments in Varna as we we can tell it's not that expensive you know yeah. so just find a secure and clean environment or building another point or another thing to look out for is check an apartment that is furnished you don't want to move into an apartment that doesn't have a That's fridge sparsely furnished you know <laughs> exactly i had a um, well, I've gone through something where, you know, I moved into an apartment and nothing was working. Oh, like, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, nothing was working in the building and I had to move out. So make sure you get an apartment that you know that everything inside, like the AC is working, the hot water, you know, the boiler is working. Everything. Everything, yeah. yeah. As I also experienced something like that in my first year. I moved into like a studio apartment uh, it costs much, uh, but it, for the price, it didn't uh, it meet didn't up with. Sense. Yeah, it oh, did not make sense. I, I had no bed. Mm -hmm. uh, like it was like a furniture. It was like a sofa bed. But for the price I was like paying, for the price I was paying, that it shouldn't have been like that. Mm -hmm. But luckily enough, I got smarter and. I moved. Yeah, so, so that's why it's very important when you're coming to Vanna as a first time, like for your first time as a student, yeah. look for agency that are serious and if you know people in Vanna, if, just message even a random student, they will help you or they will, you know, put you in contact with someone that they know yeah. is good with apartments because if you make that mistake that, okay, let me take it into my own hands, they can scam you and then you end up end up paying a lot you might move into an apartment that doesn't have a bed like my friend ridiculous yeah. she was paying so much for this apartment and it's not even up to like and you see an apartment with that price now you'll be like oh my god exactly uh, what was i doing so be careful like just make sure you get a great agent there's a lot of them online we will put a, a link below recommending yeah some agencies or like some names so i'll leave them in the description box guys if you find an apartment that you like you like the furniture you like how clean it looks don't forget to check for the heating or the don't forget to look out for the air conditioning system try and see if there is an air conditioning system in the bedroom and in the living room living area don't forget yeah like now our ac is on so you definitely need that for yeah. the so in the summer you need the ac in the winter you, you need, need the, the ac, AC. So so it's very important very yeah no go vaginal no wow okay come on come on again no go vaginal we are bulgaskians i call out i call us the bulgaskians that's what i've come up with 
people that come from abroad <laughs> we are bulgarians okay so another tip i would recommend is make sure you check you read your contract in depth like read your contract like not just say okay because they have the uh, bulgarian side and then the english side yeah make sure you read your contract before signing it because some landlords uh would tell you okay before you move out of the apartment you need to find somebody else for the apartment so they don't need to spend money and find you know put yeah. their uh to put their apartment on the website so that they have to pay you know what i mean so yeah. your, your contract, contract your lease mm -hmm. make sure it favors you mm -hmm. or that you are okay make sure you're okay with the conditions yeah yeah everything. because some conditions will be like if you don't pay your rent on time you have to pay you half have of to the pay 0.5 uh, yeah. percent mm -hmm. at, with each day that, that you're lagging behind yeah. yeah so ensure that you read it in debt guys even if you need a lawyer go get yourself a lawyer but that's yeah. a bit too much yeah another thing to look out for while uh, searching for apartments is fi uh, find out with your landlord if you're to pay your rent um in cash or if you have to go pay it at a bank mm -hmm. just so there is no it's not really an important um advice but yeah just so you just know just so you know yeah. ask your landlord mm -hmm. whether he wants it in cash or oh. whether he or she wants it in cash or at the bank yeah uh, another tip i would give you is to make sure you buy a metro bank card when you're leaving the uk to come here for example or another country yeah a metro bank card is very important because then you don't have to pay for exchange rate but it's really difficult to get it i tried to get it but i can't get it but maybe some of you have heard about it get a metro bank card so you can remove money at no cost no extra cost okay mm -hmm. another thing people actually ask or are worried about is when they when you're a first year student you the agency that you go with usually pair you up with somebody or unless you you know choose who you want to move with yeah. so also beware of who you move in with you know moving with someone that is a friend or someone that is like i guess nice you know because you don't want to move in with someone and then you find out that their character it. is completely different yeah. then you have to move out again you know what i mean um a friend you know like you've known for long not mm -hmm. all these pen pals or yeah. online friends yeah i recommend like someone you have met mm -hmm. occasionally or mm -hmm. someone you you are you friends know. With, you yeah. know yeah. yeah because you find that you get with somebody that you knew during the entrance no the the entrance exam or something and, and then you live with that person for a year and you're like you know what i, I don't vibe with this person the same way so you have yeah. to move out again so we live actually apart we are friends but we, we live, live apart. apart so that's how we prefer it we prefer it we all live apart in different homes it's also something you need to think about do you want to live with a friend or do you want to live by yourself hey okay, guys so it's a wrap <laughs> we hope you enjoyed this video and we hope you got a few tips mm -hmm. and good advice from what we have said so far mm -hmm. thank you for watching <laughs> wow so formal <laughs> anyways thanks so much guys for watching please make sure you don't get scammed like me <laughs> or my friend don't get scammed okay listen to the points that we've listed out go do your research do a lot of research and go out of your way to actually ask for help you know yeah. there are students here that would help you go in the uh, muv marketplace in um, on facebook find someone ask them how did they get their apartment oh, they will most likely answer your question end of the video thank you so much for watching this video thank we you will watching. see you all in our next video don't forget to subscribe like share and check out my friends page as well i will leave it down below thank you guys Bye! Bye.